we got on the road early this morning. I'm gonna head up to the mountains and see if there's any water that's not totally blown out with this early spring runoff that's starting right about now. We got some rain the past few days, so could be uh, water could be a little high, but uh, we'll uh, we'll see how it goes. Cheers. So, I just got to the river, found this awesome campsite right on the river, and uh, I honestly couldn't be happier. The water looks amazing. It's early season and a little bit colder, so there's not too many people around, and uh, I can't wait to go fishing. Sometimes I get a little too excited to hit the water and I forget my camera batteries back to the truck. Got to hike back and get them. Let's get a little closer. So apparently, I should be turning this into a how to farm a hook set instructional video. out here. I think I'm just gonna hang out the rest of the afternoon and fish a little more in the evening to see if there's any hatches coming off. And it doesn't really get any better than this. So that's a wrap on day one. A really, really awesome day today. Got into a bunch of brown trout. 
So I've got the full day to fish tomorrow, and I think I'm gonna head down south and explore some areas I haven't haven't seen yet, and see what I can get into. Uh, but that's about it. I'm gonna hang out in the camper for a little bit, and then uh, then turn in for the night. not seeing anything rising so stick to nymphing for now until that changes couldn't ask for better weather water's a little high but it's not too off color you can still see through it pretty well so gonna keep walking down river and see what there is to see saw there's still a lot of snow on the high peaks but once that starts melting summer's gonna be here and can't wait see you guys on the next one after when you brushed your teeth when it comes to pushing shots